Welcome back, my writer friends. And if you're new, hi, my name is Alma from almacane.com and I've been a freelance writer for many, many years. And for today's video, I'm gonna be helping you find some freelance writing jobs using a premium job board called Writer's Work. Have you heard about Writer's Work? It's a cool budget-friendly job board and I totally love it. I've used it for a couple of years. And what I like about it, that it's an all-in-one platform for writers. It's not only going to help you find jobs, it's going to help you build your portfolio, market your po portfolio, set your writing goals, and so much more. Like I am very impressed with all the new features that they're, they've recently added. So let's get to it. I want to show you writer's work if you're interested. And anytime in this video, you can check the description below to find the link to sign up to writer's work. And just to let you know, if you are new to freelance writing, you can always enroll in my free email course, Get Paid to Write, to find your first client. All right, so let's get to it. Here is writer's work. So let's go through it and see what type of things you can get out of this platform. So one of the biggest things, of course, is finding jobs. You don't need to spend hours hunting for jobs on all these other free job boards. You can go to a premium job board that has premium listings and listings from writer's work, which is pretty cool. Many of these are high paying as well. They're not just budget writers, there are copywriters, copy editors, transcription writers, medical writers, medical copywriters, lots of exclusive types of jobs like that. You can start building your portfolio with their submission feature. This is recently new. They have a section for submissions that are free to to submit and that will pay you as well. <laughs> so you can build your portfolio with writing samples, get published right away and get paid. So I think that's really cool. No need to start searching for a guest posting on Google. You can just go right to writer's work, go to their tab, pick the niche, the industry, lifestyle, sports, entertainment, and then find the exact submissions to write for. What's cool is that you can actually do your writing in their platform. I really like the layout. The platform is very intuitive. It's user friendly. It's fresh. It's big. It's nice. I like all of that. Very modern. And what's cool is that you can listen to music, coffee chatter music. Um, I can't share with you because of copyright reasons, but um, I really like the Hogwarts library uh, chatter music. It's really fun. So you can plug that in while you're working away and have distraction free writing, which is my goal every day. <laughs> After you do your writing, they have a built in grammar checker, which I really like. They tell you exactly what your readability score is and the grade level of your writing. Ideally for clients, you wanna be in the fourth to eighth grade level right there. And some other stats here, your reading time, speaking time, it says here, sentences, words, characters, and then the sentiment, you know, is it positive, negative? I don't know what other sentiments, I've only gotten positive, so <laughs> I'm not sure if I wrote something really sad, if that would be the sentiment. All right, and then of course you can set your deadlines, all your client pieces, Instead of having a project management system, you can use Writer's Work as your project management system and set all your client work and deadlines there, which is kind of nice. Again, all in one place for you. And you can set your writing goals. I recently did a YouTube live on my writing goals and one of them is to write 3,000 words a day. If I wanted to within Writer's Work, I could, I could do that. Unfortunately, I do write other content all over online, so that's not gonna help me. But again, if you wanna work on your writing goals within Writer's Work, with your client pieces, this can get you started, All right? And then if you go to the top to the freelance marketplaces, your profile can be marketed here. So you can see Alan right here is a write your way to your first 1K course student. And then you can see uh, their writing samples and what they charge for their rates. So you can see all here. It's all, it all varies depending, but I have a feeling that your pro profile will get featured if you update it re recently. I'm not sure how they pick or they just randomly pick uh, writers to feature. So if you go to become a writer, you can see that this is a budget friendly platform. My suggestion is to do the one time fee of $47. It's the most popular and it's 50% off. It's the early bird registration. If you want to pay monthly, it's $15 a month. But again, I'd rather just pay once and then forget about it. That's what I did and I've had this for years. I had this job board for years and I, I love it. It's one of my favorites to use. All right, so let's go into it. Let's see what this is all about. All right, so when you log in, you do wanna set up your profile. It'll probably walk you through all that. So I'll show you quickly my profile. 
So my profile is this. I can take the URL and put that in my pitches if I want. If I don't have a portfolio, I can send them this because it has my portfolio pieces. It has all the services so they can look at all the different services here. I think with writer's work, you just sort of tick all the ones that apply to you. And then they can learn about my service specifically. Right. So this is a nice little page that they can use and I can submit to my pitches if I wanted to. But within writer's work, here is the platform. It tells you all the words you've typed for the day here so far. I spent one minute typing it. So 95 words a minute, not bad. <laughs> uh, it shows featured jobs, right? Right there. So medical copywriter, a copywriter editor, a freelance writer right there. You can list all your projects for your client work here. That's what I did, your client orders. These are all your documents. Here's the job section. So if you wanna look at the job section, again, you can just choose a freelance if you want. So I don't want contract work. I don't want full-time work or internship or unpaid. I just want freelance. So that can cut, again, your time in half as well, or you can search certain industry topics but you can see all of this. You can even go, you know, you just want to get paid per article and then see the ones that want per article. And then it can, you can decide per article is probably, let's do 150. And then it'll give me these for sure will pay. And this is actually a good thing. If they posted years ago, I can go and pitch to them and this could be the perfect time that they need a writer right now, right? So you can play around with this. It's really customizable and I really like that. But here you go, here are all the freelance jobs. And again, repitch to them if you already pitched them. Don't worry about how old the job ad is, just go and pitch to them again. Um, they do have a submission section, which I really like. This is a new feature. You can pick the category. So if I wanna do all sports, and again, some are paid, some are not but it's a great starting strategy for building your portfolio. So here, this one pays $250 and it's in my niche in sports, perfect. I can pitch to that. Hopefully they'll accept my submission. I'll get paid and boom, I have a paid writing sample right there. Perfect. It, this really saves time to build your portfolio and just help you get into the field of being a paid writer. All right, so those are the biggest features that I like and I use in writer's work. If you are new to freelance writing and you don't wanna compete with all the free job boards, granted they are great to use, but I mean, you're competing with up to like thousands of writers. I would suggest, you know, investing in a premium job board like writer's work. It's a one-time fee and you have access to all the jobs here. I mean, they're curating jobs from online, but they have, they curate jobs on business pages that are hiring. They curate jobs within the writer's work, you know, global area there. <laughs> so that's pretty cool. So you get a lot and as well, it really helps you focus your writing and improves your writing with their tools that they have. All right, so if you want, click the link in the description below. I will have a blog post about writer's work coming soon. So that will probably be added so you can always check that if it's there. And don't forget to sign up to my free e-course, Get Paid to Write, so you can find your first client. All right, I hope you like this video. Smash that like button, subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you in the next video.